I feel like Bale becomes like a low tier character because like what the hell? What the What the hell does Bale do? I think he meant we, he mentioned that when we talked about the set. Are you dead? Oh my god, you're dead. That didn't kill. They were at the ledge. Try to read a jump get up there. A lot of people DI bad on jump get ups because they're holding away after they do jump get up. Not sure why. Oh my, the, the slick is there, bear. Y'all try doing that at home. You can't. You simply can't. The uh, winners finals of Lost Tech City. Lima actually beat Meister to get here, which uh, if you ask me what I think Bayonetta Game of Watch is, it's unwinnable for Bayonetta, but he did it. Lost Tech City, one of the stops of the Panda Cup, was won by one of our Panda members, and unfortunately it wasn't me or Wadi, it was Mars. And we are going to be watching his set where he beat Lima, Texas's number one or two player, and the, one of the best, if not the best, Bayo in the world. So we're gonna get into it. Zero Suit versus Bayo. Both of them suck compared to their Smash 4 counterparts, but obviously, as I said, Mars won. Uh, he does a little better, so let's watch it. All right, Mars and Lima. So I'm surprised that he let me start PS2. I think, uh,. The more space, the the more space, the worse off for Bayonetta. Normally, she she just doesn't want Smashville, and that's the only no-no stage for Bayonetta. Like obviously, battle um, FD is kind of rough for her because landing can be a little hard. Actually, I don't know. You probably actually want to play this. Zero Suit's not gonna have the best time punishing. I feel like it's just gonna come down to kill differentials because Zero Suit can definitely kill really well, and Bayo cannot. Like Bayo, if you if you have the good SDI, you don't really die to characters combos. You need like witch time into smash attacks. Uh, like that, like you're just getting out of it, right? Mars is just going to win off of kills, I think. I don't see Mars losing this, and the reason, and the reason being, isn't because I don't think Lima isn't good enough. Because I think Lima's good enough to beat Mars. The problem is the character. I got deleted from that. Jesus, I remember SDIing that in, and I still got deleted. Hot side be alert. Woo! Sick tea bag. That was an ultimate moment right there. Just getting stuck on that platform. Yeah, like that's so good in the matchup. That should be most of the matchup is me jumping and then getting side beat and taking about 60 for it. So if you have good enough SDI or you don't start it on a platform, like you're going to be much more comfortable just like not dying and you're going to die there with the whiff punish. That was really good. It's just scary, right? Because you, you you notice at some point here that Mars doesn't pull the trigger on the kick. So you're like, okay, well, I'm going to swing because there's no way he has advantage. But then, pop, with the down smash. Super good. Down B is also super free to catch. Also, micro space champ. Hello? Kind of cold with it. <laughs> okay. I mean, that was a good punish. Oh, I like the punish. Didn't quite have enough time or wasn't comfortable enough to get like near up smash. So just, yeah, forward smash, a solid 20. See, like, like that was 17, so forward smash was better. Me and Mars had the same reaction. I cannot believe that went backwards. I did not expect that paralyzer to hit. Could you tell by my punish? That was a miss input. And I'm a C stick masher and I play smash stick, so. Again, like, hey, Lima's holding his own. Because Lima's good, but I mean the character choice is just it's just kind of tragic against Mars. Cause like, damn. But I like I like seeing Lima get farther in these in these brackets. Lima is up there in in the more enjoyable players for me to watch. I, whenever there was a Bayo on the screen in Smash Four, I would turn it off. I would fall asleep. It was like it was like a sleeping pill. Is that a witch time? That could have been really bad. Yeah, I'm starting the SDI down. I'm taking a lot of damage for it. Obvious, obvious Bayonetta back here in the corner. That sh killed early. Oh, Perry's back and forth. Oh, I thought that was going to be up. Oh, I think Luma's dead. He made that back. Wow. I thought he already used his double jump instead of the triple jump. So I just have to not get back aired and I have to not get up tilt back aired and not get witch time. But he did that for some reason and donated me the game like an absolute homie. I guess there's no way he expected he was gonna get punished for this because it, clearly he wasn't expecting Mars to hit him because nothing will hit Lima there. I don't know a single character that can hit Bayo there. Hey, baby. I think just bad, Not didn't realize that Mars would be there. It's crazy, in every single Smash game they're both in, Zero Suit loses the matchup. All two of them. <laughs> that shouldn't be true. That's. Where it's like a up smash and I'm way the hell out of here. And ZS has long ass leg. This IB covers everything. My God, yeah. ABK, super good in this matchup. So he counterpicked the town. Surely with the intention of uh, oh getting red by my 
Mars's uh, body wasn't quite out of it. Like Lima didn't quite run far or roll far enough. So Mars's up B was gonna hit the wrong way. And you can't run through there because you can't run through. Oh wait, no, you can run through with down smash. So Mars should have just ran through up B, but maybe just didn't trust it. I don't know. I tried to sauce on him. Tried to do fair one paralyzer jab lock slash tech chase. That shouldn't be a thing either. Just saying. Just saying. That, 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 that shouldn't be a thing either. I thought. I thought the phrase was "ZSS sucks." I thought that was the phrase that we used because that doesn't look very sucky to me. He was taking way too long to recover. That's a free down smash every time. Although on paper, Zerusu really shouldn't be able to edge guard uh, Bayonetta. I do have to show that I'm at least covering the options so that you know it, it might make him make a mistake. You know, I'm not really going to commit to anything too stupid. I think I was dead no matter what I DI'd there. Yeah, Mars DI'ing behind Lima, you're definitely, I think, supposed to DI in front just to make the back air a little harder, whether they have to jump forward or turn around if they want to, like, switch the DI. I think he, meant, we, he mentioned that when we talked about this set. Are you dead? Oh my god, you're dead. That didn't kill? They were at the ledge. I'm about to say, I'm about to say, ain't no way. Tap jump player alert. I should have actually just nared. Oh, uh, no, because nair back air is not true if you DI properly. Lima at least knows how to DI Nair Bear, so. Boost Kick probably would have done it. Oh, cheeky. Cheeky fair, I like counter edge guards. I'm pissed. This is an interesting situation right here. So you you have this area where like, honestly back air would have hit that entire time, but Lima's waiting for an air dodge or like a down B so that he can reverse witch twist me and then I'm out of resources and then I just die. He could have back aired but he expected me to air dodge, which makes sense, but I just forward aired and he wasn't ready. Oh, you're dead as hell. Cause you have so much lag anyway. You know, I always find it funny. Every Bayo does that sh Ooh. Every Bayo does that shit when they, when they, when they, when they get off the, 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 the heaven platform, whenever they get off the respawn platform, they do, they do like a, a smash attack. I don't know what the hell started that, but every Bayo does it. Woo, clean with the, dude, how fast was that? Look at these down tilts. I'm crispy clean with it. You can't even see when I turn around. Oh, nice up B. But again, nothing. Oh, I thought that was gonna be an up air. Beautiful parry. Dude, the New England players are so good at parrying. Like, Light and Mars are so good at parrying. It's obnoxious. So you know what I actually think I could have done? So I was out of resources here. I had no double jump and I had no down B. So air dodge is the only thing I could do. I think if I back aired right here, I would not have gotten hit by this last bullet. And I would have actually been able to just up B and recover. Yo, bars mashes up smash. I hate it. Cause you're like, okay, it stopped working like twice. And I punished you really hard for it. And he's like, what if I do it a third time? And it's like, oh, okay, cool, thanks. I guess you were right, and then you dealt me 30 and had advantage state. Great. Taking damage in this matchup really doesn't matter. Like, most of what's going to ha be happening is me avoiding getting killed. So I play most of the game at, like, kill percent, which isn't that bad. I just have to not be an idiot. He also hadn't been side being a lot of my jumps recently. So I was like, maybe I can actually get away with going in the air. You know, the, enti the entire end of, like, that previous game was me mostly just jump, like, just staying grounded and praying for an opening. Oh, hit the witch time. Sucks for Lima. But as a certified Mars fan, we take those! Of course he shields. He's a coward, baby. Oh, but I'm saying if he side Bs and he whiffs, he can just double jump onto the platform and wave land or go through. Like that. Wow. I know a thing or two about a thing or two about a thing or two about a thing or two. You know, I, I always feel like Bale sucks. Whenever you whenever you get past like like one one fifty. Like one fifty, one forty. I feel like Bale becomes like a low tier character because like what the hell? What the What the hell does Bale do? Yeah, Sharking Bayonet is really scary because if you're predictable even one time, you just get like, you know, which time to delete it. That was terrible, DI. I think I could have lived if I DI'd in. Oh, good. Oh, good combo by Lima. Still has advantage. 
I know Mars wins this game, but he doesn't have a lot of resources. Yeah, I think I think Lima didn't realize how many resources Mars had because I think he still has everything here, but I'm pretty sure he gets hit out of his double jump. Yeah, there's double jump. I guess he, okay, he tried to read down B. That, that's, it's down B versus air dodge, and Mars, I feel like, guesses right nine times out of 10 there. Ah, oh, that's a that's a that's a that's a sad way to go. That's a sad way to go. You can you can kind of see while watching why this is kind of a rough matchup, and like you could be like, oh, ooh, that was kind of clean. Hold up, I should have just went for the back air. This dude died hella early. You love to see it. Who goes to small battlefield? I hate this pick for uh, Lima. I think small battlefield is probably Zero Suit's best or second best stage. It's like this in town. Obviously it's matchup dependent, but like this stage is ridiculous for Zero Suit because it's the normal ceiling. You get ladders with the platform and it's just like, it's just perfect for her. She has like drop off Zero on the platforms. Like it's a way better stage for her in my opinion than PS2. And I don't, and I think that fact is supported by most of the Zero Suit players. So kind of a similar small battlefield, you know, Smash Bros really good. Platforms, yada, yada, you know the deal. That was a, that was an insane air dodge. Mars, even though he's a, an amazing player, he's not a combo zero suit. He is a advantage state zero suit. He's a read zero suit. He doesn't, he doesn't get optimal damage like most of the time. Uh, and he still like uh, doesn't do some of the like, some of the newer kill confirms. It's scary that he's still lacking. I feel like a decent amount and he still beats people's ass. Like again, that's not an insult. It's just everyone's lacking something, right? Except for you, because the only thing you could be lacking is not being subscribed to the channel, but you're obviously subscribed to the channel with notifications turned on because you rang that bell, right? Absolutely, of course. Yeah, I played this a little too campy. In hindsight, I could be taking more risks, and like I am the one that kind of decides the pace for the most part, but I have to be wary of that side B so often or else I take so much damage. See what I mean? Like, it's such a good option in the matchup. It, the, the entire neutral is me playing around it and him playing around me playing around it. Or just doing it anyway, because why not? Terrible for it air. What are you doing? My first edge guard. He could have just stalled with an up B and it would have been fine. Yeah, wow. Oh. <laughs> Dude, I feel like this move sucks. Like, this is bad. I feel like this should never work, and it always works. As, at least against characters like Pika, which he hits me with it a lot. Against, like, Bale. Like, he could have just side beat here and been fine. And, like, we always are like, he's not going to do it. It's a bad option. Then he doesn't, and we get hit, and we just go, damn it. I think that I think that confirm looks kind of kind of nice, you know. It's a good looking confirm, you know. There are some ugly ass confirms in the. There's a, every all the most confirms in this game look ugly as. Shit. But that's a good looking confirm, gotta say. I tried to kill him for that taunt, hundred percent, hundred percent wanted him dead for that one, and then I would have taunted right back. <laughs> oh, ah, oh, didn't get as much. I didn't watch the set live because I fi I figured once Mars beat me i was like oh based on matchups he wins the tournament because it's either like lima or meister and he will win or and then he'll probably beat zomba even though i'm pretty sure that set was pretty close try to read a jump get up there a lot of people di bad on jump get ups because they're holding away after they do jump get up not sure why oh my the, the slick is there bear y'all try doing that at home you can't you simply can't Hey, Lima making them work for it. I'll tell you that. Lima making them work for it. Oh, ah, uh, Lima was hella right. <gasps> uh, I would have died. I got hit by that Nair somehow, even though Mars is the one that messed it up, but I would have got hit and died. Ooh, his life flashed before his eyes. That Nair. Very greedy side B from him. See, that's what I'm mostly fishing for when I'm shielding is for him to side B through me, then I back air him. But he very rarely gives it to me. I end up cheesing most of these stocks. Wow, you know, watching this back, did I deserve to win? I don't know. Mm, that's a lot of grabs from Mars. Finally, that one's up throw, he's just gonna back air. I knew it. I knew he was just gonna go up and back air. Oh, Mars, another grab. Like, at high percents, you're so scared of him just running up and shielding, which is how he conditions you to just get hit by a billion grabs. And, dude, that's so good. 
Got him. He ain't do that all. He Mars killed him with two things that he didn't do the entire set. That are things that he does commonly, or ZSS does commonly, which is the, which is the down B at the ledge right there at the end, and the side B off stage. He waited till the last game. He waited because he he was gonna close it out. He wanted to close it out, so he he whipped out. Just two big kill mix-ups got the job done. He asks me for uh, advice after this, and I tell him, I don't know. I have nothing constructive to say. I have no good advice. You play a weird character, I play a weird character, but that's how I made uh, winners whatever. I have my blue lights on. I've been blue this whole time. The runoff double jump, the runoff down B back into two frame down B, it's, it's, just, it's just so good. I know that wasn't a two frame because Lima poked his head, but like, it's so scary. Cause like, you run off, so you're like, oh, I'm gonna panic. And if you panic with neutral get up, you get hit. If you panic with roll, you get hit by the flip jump part of it or the, the footstool part of it. The only option there is to jump, but it's terrifying to jump because Mars might also just randomly raw back air or like dash up side B and hit you. So it's, it's just a just a no win position, except for Mars. Mars wins, Mars wins. The best player in the world confirmed clickbait on his channel, which you should go check out by the way in the description for the next like four months. warning warning <laughs> mars is great he did so good he played amazing at the tournament it was ridiculous